What is going on, believers? Guys, we got a phantom update out of nowhere. Uh, we have some working video of uh, a little bit about the phantom app so you can see uh, the, the design, see what it looks like. It's the direct messaging portion. This is not financial advice, but I'm always right. Everybody listen up. Listen up. Listen up. Let's get it. Let's get it. I'm trying to put money in your pocket, that crypto wallet, that bing bada bing ching ching big profit. Even when the market sideways, I'm looking for ways to get paid. All right, guys, here we are. Uh, we're going to take a quick look. Uh, this is the working prototype. Uh, you're going to see what it looks like right here. Obviously, my name's Kill Switch. Everybody else is whoever. Uh, but uh, you, you're going to see here uh, this thing in action. And see what it looks like, and uh, we'll give it a test run and see we'll see if we like it. Okay, guys, as you can see from that, uh, a couple things to point out that circle, the reason that there was a circle moving around on the screen is because it's being programmed, uh, even though it's a, an app, it's being programmed for PC on a P PC, or it's being programmed on a PC. So that's simulating uh, a finger, uh, part of the protocol for. All right, guys, what you just witnessed was the direct messaging function. You can see it looks, feels a lot like, and there are plenty of skins, by the way, looks, feels kind of like Telegram. That's the idea. That's what we're trying to, to bring forth. Uh, in, in a couple of the channels, you're going to feel a little bit more like Twitter. You're going to feel, uh, it's all crypto oriented though. And that's going to be a really cool sort of thing. Now, uh, let's move on. There is another piece uh, to this puzzle, and we are going to share that right now. We're going to look at a statement given by Matthew, the CEO of Phantom. Uh, good evening, operatives. I want to provide you all with an update on the latest features to be developed for our application. Similar to the last one, this was pretty self-explanatory. It's our direct messaging feature of the application. Speaking of this feature in particular, I don't have anything exciting to share. When developing this feature, we decided we just wanted to follow industry standards and not try and reinvent the wheel when it comes to this feature. Uh, as the way it is done is more than sufficient. This is not where our application is going to stand out and shine. We want to provide to our users everything they already get from social media, plus so much more. We're developing our application with the intent of creating a user experience that is familiar to those who already use social media, while also creating a great experience for those who may be new to social media, but also the DeFi space. With development of this feature now complete outside of possible minor changes and fixes, we're moving on to our development time on some of the bigger features that take a lot longer to develop. That being said, uh, you all will still be provided with updates. However, instead of an update about a feature being complete, it will probably be about the progress being made on the development of the next feature. Hope you all are just as excited as I am about the work being done on our Phantom app. Please let me know if you have any questions or suggestions or feedback. So uh, there you have it from the horse's mouth directly. What is going on and what will be coming forward in the future? Moving on. All right, guys, they called it dead. They said it was a rug. They did everything they could to FUD the project because they didn't like one person that was associated with it. Yet here we are about two and a half months away from the launch of the Phantom app. And it is still on track 
it's still happening in a timely fashion and it's going to be i don't know if it's going to be a hit i'll be fair with you i don't know if it's going to be a hit but what it's going to be is a functioning app that with a little bit of promotional material behind it is going to get quite a few people at least interested and intrigued and it will attract investors because people do want to see a product that's competitive with other products that they know have i think uh, uh, it, it's my understanding that Telegram has 750 million users. So if uh, in the crypto space, we could just get 100,000 of those people all dedicated to crypto, then you have an advertising space uh, for 100,000 crypto people. What do you think the value of something like that would be worth? It's going to be a lot. So uh, I feel real comfortable. I'm real happy with the progress that I've seen so far. And I can't wait to see what the future brings. This is not financial advice. My name is Bleeves, and I am always, always right. I'm trying to put money in your pocket, that crypto wallet, that bing, bada, bing, ching, ching, big profit. Going the market sideways. I'm looking for ways.